Nathan, you ready for what's about to happen? Ready, Freddy. So, tell me about your, your earbud situation here. These are the ones that come when you buy an iPhone. This is what I use and I'm perfectly fine using it. So, what we're doing today is we're gonna be upgrading Nathan's listening experience. We're gonna be showing him three different headphones, three different prices. He's gonna determine which one's most worth it, so to speak. So, of course, we're gonna be starting off with these free ones. Ooh, I don't even want to, uh, uh, I've had these for a while, okay? They're, they're okay, they work. They do work. Do they sound good? I think they sound fine. So these are Apple's older generation earbuds. These aren't their newest ones. This is true. Otherwise, it would have just had a lightning adapter at the bottom. So, we're gonna be opening up Spotify. Nah, I'm kidding, SoundCloud. Nah, Spotify. You ready? I don't know what we're testing right now because this is what I'm gonna be used we're to. We're testing sound quality. Which song is your favorite? Thank you, next. Now let's listen to Ruin My Life. <laughs> All right, why not? Zara Larson, newest hit. How does this sound? Sounds like every single day. Oh, wait, I got an idea. Every day we Actually, lit. I feel like your bass is really amplified. I didn't I didn't adjust anything. We're gonna listen to a different song. We're gonna try Phenomenal. Alright, this is by Rational. I feel like it's something Nathan hasn't experienced yet in his no. everyday life. We're gonna listen to about 30 seconds. This way you can get a lay of the land. Let us know what he's feeling. Not bad, right? Sounds good? I'll, I'll stop talking. Is the volume good? Volume's too high, too low? It's pretty good. It's pretty good. I mean, this is kind of what I'm used to. I feel like the bass is a little bit more amplified. Yeah. I know that since we're using Tidal, the quality of the music will be a lot better than just, just Spotify. Yeah. Free I like the bass amplification. You like it? I do. This is what, ow. <laughs> what? That's how Apple designs it, so they don't pull out when All you All right, well, I mean, that's the problem right there. So, I mean, the free ones, the ones that come with your phone, you like them, right? You're I do used like to them. them. I do like them. They're free. Time to upgrade it a little bit. So, for our second level, these ones go for 250 bucks. These are, of course, the AirPods. All right, here we go. Number two, it's already paired to my phone, super easy. You simply just open it, you close it. It's already attached. Put them in your ear, what are you doing? They are different designs. They do have different sort of vents. Yeah, I noticed that they had the extra dot there. So that is a sensor so that Apple can communicate with your phone and lets it know that they're in your ear. And these have can... a speaker on them too, right? So you can yeah. call somebody? Yeah. That's pretty cool. Or a mic. But yeah, so if you are playing music and you take them out of your ear, it will automatically pause the music. Oh, that's cool. They sound a bit well, different. It's just the beginning, so I can't really meet. They sound different. All right, I'll, I'll stop talking. Let's let him listen. So. I see a smile emerging. I see a smile I, emerging. To be honest, I didn't really notice a big difference between, between these ones and my free ones here. I was also gonna add that one thing you have to worry about with these Bluetooth speakers, sorry, Bluetooth headphones is charging. Another positive to these things, to the, to the Bluetooth headphones is you can charge your phone while listening to these. But one thing that I really don't like is if I wanna listen to music and my phone's at 5%, I have to sacrifice not listening to music or an audiobook an and charge audio my phone. Book. Here we go. But in terms of sound quality, I notice very little difference. Which one would you rather have? I still think $200 is very, very steep for these. That's true. Very well, steep. Well, then you're not gonna like our next, <laughs> our next item. All right, put them back inside the thing. Let them charge. Oh, you had a 50-50 chance of getting it right, Nathan. So, next up we have the ultimate home listening setup, headphone-wise. So this we, isn't something that you take on the road with you. This is not. This is something you stay inside, you listen to it, you enjoy. I feel like Nathan needs to open his eyes. This man's like, I'm not gonna spend more than a nickel on some headphones. What can you buy in today, in 2018, that is a nickel? A lot, actually. A lot. What? All right, here we go. Put these on. So these go for around five thousand dollars. This is a $5, lot. Five thousand dollars. Five thousand dollars. You sounded amazed. So it is a headphone amplifier setup. They're very different to what the other one has. I feel like this is an unfair so comparison. So is this dongle gonna <coughs> ruin the sound quality at all? No. No. I don't feel like it. I don't feel like it would. All right, we're gonna be testing it out. You ready? You excited? Ready. You feeling amped? Oh, for some reason. Oh, here we go. Ooh. Now, this one does use a little tiny knob. So these are not noise canceling. These are not. I see a smirk on his face. Woo! 
We'll let that settle in for a minute. I, I will have to admit these, the quality on these are very good. One thing that I did notice just comparing all three of these is that Apple really likes to amplify their bass. Yeah, so, so these are flat. Impressions, $5,000. Did you like them? If you didn't tell me the price, I'd be like, wow. I want, I want these. You want these? Yeah. I don't think you can properly compare the Apple no, ones that's to these fair. because these are more like you can use every day. You yeah. can travel with them. You can put them in your pocket on the train or in the car. But with these, you have to listen to them at home or if you're fortunate enough to have a studio in the studio. You remember back in the day when like your parents would walk around that big boom box? Like you'd be walking around like this, like, yeah. What? <laughs> your parents did that? Oh my. People did that back in the People day. People did that. Did Ask your, your dad if he did that. Price difference. For $5,000, $5, I would have to say no. No. No, but not for $5,000. Were they the best things you ever heard? They were very, very good. For something that is 20 times the price of these, mm -hmm. I didn't notice the 20 times of amplified sound quality. So, at the end of the day, which one is most worth it? You got the free ones, you got the AirPods, you got this for every day sort of listening. For every day, these, these I would say right. that that these ones, what are these called? That's Sennheiser HD800S. For these ones, I would say, for everyday use, these ones are out. Which which headphone is most worth it? Yeah. I would say that these ones are. Oh, he's gonna, he's gonna hate me, but I would say these still are. No. If I you can get over know. using your phone or always having a good charge on your phone, these ones are. He's gonna say AirPods. these ones. These are 100% most worth it. You're investing $250. I put these in my ear. I don't need to worry about where my phone is. I think it's more worth it because then you're not worrying about a cable. You know, you're doing stuff, you could be cooking. The cable does get kind of annoying. Right? You're working out, you work out with these. Mm -hmm. I feel like you could use the benefit of wireless. Probably, if they were cheaper. Steep. If I, if these were $100, I'd probably be more inclined to purchase them. Yeah. $200? $250. $250, wow. $250, dollars $250, I would, it's no, it's a no for me. All right, so that was this episode, most worth it. I feel like the AirPods, Nathan went, well, of course, with the OG headphones that Apple gives you inside of the box. Are you guys more inclined to get the AirPods? These are becoming a lot more popular. I see or, a bunch of people walking. Through. Or do you like rocking the, the wired headphones? Let us know. I do actually want to know, so let us know.